Yeah, my hair is fucked up. <laughs> Yo, I need a haircut. Let me tell you, baby. You know what it is, baby. Don't mind me, folks. I'm just putting these pins on my hat real quick. Pins of today. Pins of today. I'm going to show y'all. I'm going to show y'all. You know what I mean? 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 What up, dope people? How y'all doing? How y'all doing? How y'all feeling? Happy Monday. Happy Monday. For anybody that's here and all with me. Where the fruit at? Ah, I got to get the fruit on. I got to get the fruit. Need the fruit. Need the fruit. Woo! Almost poked my finger. <laughs> almost poked my finger. Almost poked my finger. Almost, 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 almost poked my finger. Almost, 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 almost poked my finger. Just so y'all know it. Just so y'all know it. Just so y'all know it. These are the pins for today. I got the fruit. Rocking with fruit for life. I got my boys. I got my boys brand. Najee differently uptown. And of course, we always promote mental health on this station. On this stream. Station. Stream. Whatever the hell it's called. I don't know. I'm illiterate as fuck. It's okay to not be okay. You know what I mean? We always promote mental health here, baby. Woo! Yo. Make sure I should straight. Aha! What up, folks? What up? What up? What up? What up? Welcome to the Come Kick It stream with yours truly rude, 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 rude boy. Richie, how you doing? Yo, yeah, I know, I know y'all see the tag. I know y'all see the tag. I know y'all see the tag. Yo, did they add a Guyanese tag to this? Yo. Dread, well, go on, Dread. Yo, that's crazy. I can't believe they really added a, um a Guyanese tag, bro. That is nuts. I really can't believe it. We just vibing out for now. We just vibing out. Let me get warm. I just came home from work. Um. Like about a half an hour ago, I know I'm late. Traffic was crazy. Life is getting back to norm, normal pre-COVID, post-COVID. Not pre-COVID, I'm stupid. I told you I'm illiterate. Anyways, we just vibing for now. We just vibing for now. Let it chill. Let it sit. Let it sit. I want to see I want to see what my people's doing. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I want to let it marinate real quick. You know what I mean? Let people come in. Let people settle. You know what I mean? I apologize. I was supposed to do this yesterday, but um, it's summertime, you know. Weekends getting, weekends can uh, get a little bit out of hand. <laughs> we chilling for now, though, baby. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? How y'all feeling out there? How y'all feeling out there? Make sure y'all hydrate. Make sure y'all hydrate, man. Make sure y'all hydrate. You feel me? Make sure y'all hydrate. It is hot outside. It's hot. It's hot as hell. It's hot as hell. I need a haircut and I gotta lose weight. I'm getting fat, bro. At least couldn't let me go some facial hair, cover up all these cheeks. to see it i don't got much stuff for y'all but i got some stuff you feel me i got about an hour or two worth of content we could talk about you know what i mean i guess i got about an hour or two worth of content we could talk about it's 
hot though. It was hot as fuck. Damn. It's hot as hell, it's hot as hell. Yo, yo, it is 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 hot as hell. Hot as hell. Yo, yo, it is hot as hell. Yo, yo, it's hot as hell. Ah! Five more minutes, five more minutes, and I'll begin the show. I'll kick off the show. I'm supposed to get a hanger for those shorts. I'm never prepared. It's cool, though. I'm still a small time streamer. You feel me? I ain't gotta I ain't gotta be on point all the time. Even though I'm on point, I don't gotta be on point. You know what I mean? If that makes sense. Maybe it do, hopefully it do. I don't know. It didn't make sense to me. <laughs> It didn't make sense to me, but we rocking with it. We rocking out. It's Monday. It's Monday. First day of summer. First day of summer. People, how y'all doing? How y'all doing? What up, Mango? What is going on, girl? How you doing? Came to some bars. You feel me? I'm always spitting these bars. Mango, I saw you. I saw your post, and um, I gotta say, it was touching. Um, your story, how you, you know, I'm, I'm sorry that you're going through such a rough time. I hope things are getting better. Um, but you know, I'm glad you found a friend streaming, you know, and I always say we always find like the, like the best people in the strangest ways. Uh, there's no unorthodox way to find a, you know, find a friend, but, um, your story was touching and I'm, I'm glad you're feeling better. You know, we care about mental health on this stream. You feel me? That's why we wear this pin. I mean, it's okay to not be okay. People remember that. Damn, my hair is a mess. I'm not. I'm not taking my hat off again for this. I'm, just, I'm gonna just turn to the side. Hopefully, I can just see it. Cause I am not. My hair is a mess, bro. Ooh. Get out work, but I want to say I appreciate you stopping by, Mango. You always showing love, girl. You always showing love. I really appreciate it. I appreciate you. Five thirty-two. It's hot, man. It's hot. Hey, maybe we got to appreciate mental health these, this day and age. You know, it was a rough year for a lot of people. And, um, you know, we need, we need, we need more people like you to voice it. Let it know, let it, let people know it's okay to not be okay. You know, so we all go through things, you know, don't keep it bottled in. We got to, we got to let it out. We got to let our frustrations, our anger, our, our sorrows, we got to let it out. You know what I mean? Your story could help somebody else. And then their story can help, help another person. And such is this thing is life. We got to keep it going. We got to keep it moving. You know, mental health isn't talked about a lot. In a lot of situations, a lot of care. And the funny thing is, I saw that I saw somebody post that this week is a men's mental health week or something like that. Oh, my barber posted it. And, um... Not that one. This week is Men's Health Week. There you go. 84 men. 84 men a week take their own life. Wow. 75% of suicides are male. Men are like men are less likely to get help. But speaking up saves lives. Let's encourage men to speak up, not men. I I I, I agree with that. You know, men and women. You know, <laughs> my girlfriend's playing dominoes. You better win, babe. This was a rough. It was a rough year. It was a rough year. <laughs> it was a rough year. Um, for for everybody. Let's just say everybody. You know, I mean, I like quarantine and I like COVID, but um, you know, a lot of people that are close to their families are gonna get to see their family. I, I'm I couldn't get to see my parents. I haven't seen my parents 
Um, what's up, SF? What's up, Warlord? I haven't seen my parents in um, two years. I'm going. I'm actually off. This is my last day of work for the week. I'm off until Tuesday. No, next week. Mon well, yeah, next week, Tuesday, I go back to work. But um, I'm going to go see them um, this week. Spend, spend like four or five days with them. See my mom and dad, my little sister. Um, I've kind of been always on my own. Uh, <laughs> so, like, it doesn't affect me much. I, I do miss them and everything like that. You know, there's a lot of people, other people out there that were like, that are a lot closer to their families. They, they couldn't get to see family members. They couldn't get to see loved ones. This year was rough for a lot of people mentally. And, um, you know, the more we talk about it and the more we uh, express it and the more it becomes normal, you know, to not be okay. You know, instead of just asking somebody, hey, how you doing? I'm all right, man. No. If you're not all right, say you're not all right. You know, sometimes maybe all, maybe all you, like me personally, whenever... I'm going through something. All I gotta do is voice it. All I gotta do is just get off my chest. Is let's let let, some, let like let. I usually let my. I usually tell my girlfriend like one of my best friends. Like no, like you know, like I'm going through something right now, or like I'm 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 stressed, or I'm I'm going, or I'm you know whatever. But um, usually just getting off my chest helps instead of bottling it in. Because a lot of times you know it's just really venting you need to do. You know, and, and you know, sometimes all, and all you need is somebody to listen to you. And personally, you know, everybody handles, handles their uh, <laughs> their issues different. What's up, Buddha? Tell Buddha I said, "What's up, SF? You two behave now." Yo, I tell you one thing. You know what? Here, let me pause the music. You know what, chat? I'm not okay right now. You know why? Because, yo, I haven't had a haircut in a month. And your boy is fucked up, bro. Yo, any man out there can vouch. What's up, Jamie? What up, Letty? What's up, Warlord? You handsome er devil. Yo, any man out there can vouch when they don't got a haircut. Yo, they feel like shit. <laughs> they feel like... Like, hell, they feel like they're the ugliest person in the world. I've been growing my hair for a month. Well, not growing it for a month, but I haven't had a haircut for a month to grow it. Yo, look, my shape up is even... My hair got long, though. Look, you can't even find my damn shape up line. Damn, look at it. Look, my shit just disappeared. Damn. Hey, hey, no bits, no bits, no bits. Sheesh, Letty, what up? I miss you, homie. I hope everything's well. Let me hide my hair back. <laughs> Yo, thank God for hats. Thank God for hats. Hey, 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 hey. We ain't doing the bits. We ain't doing the bits, man. We ain't seeing with the bits. We're just here for the love. We're here for the mental health, the mental capacity. You know what I mean? You know, we just hanging out. It's a hot ass Monday. I think you always wear hats on. I do for the most part. Um, yeah, I think when I had longer hair, I streamed about couple times with it tied back. Uh, for the most part, I'm always in a hat. Um, unless I'm at work, obviously. Um, and that's probably why. I don't know. I just feel more comfortable in hats. It compliments the outfit better. But um, it's a thing. As I explained last stream, hats are, uh, hats are a thing. Fashion is a thing. You know what I mean, no matter what kind of hat you got on. It could be a Florida Marlins hat. It could be a Mario hat. It could be a Yoshi hat. Yo, a Yoshi hat would be dope. But it's like his two eyes here and like the tongue sticking out. That'd be dope. Okay, I don't want to shave it. <laughs> Lead professor not alone. Chaotic would promise to shave his head. I like I like uh I like Warlord with his long hair. Warlord should have long hair, you know, if we're being technical. Warlord should have long hair. It's hot, it's nuts. Why don't I turn my TV volume down all the way? I turn. Hey! Yo, who throwing bits, bro? Y'all better stop with these bits. Chaotic! Hey! 
Infinity Gaming, what's going on? Look at all these lovely people in here today. I should just change this to a mental health stream. Hey, did you guys know, men, it's Men's Health Week? I didn't know about it today until my, bar my barber posted it. Hey, my boy Wax, what's good? No but no bits, no bits, no bits, man, no bits, man. We not bitsin. We just chilling here. We talking about mental health so far, you know, I ain't kick off the show yet. We just chilling. It's hot as hell, man. It is hot. It's like It's like it's like understand you know it's ninety degrees outside. You know what it is? You know when it's like you know when you're just sweating outside and people don't even say nothing to you, that's how sweaty that's how hot it is. Men's health important, women's health, you know, mental, just health and health itself is important, you know what I mean? We, we got to start taking care of ourselves. I tell you, man, as I get older, bro, I be, I be fucked up. <laughs> Body be aching. <laughs> Body be motherfucking aching. Wax Ketchum is the best name ever. Yo, Wax is the, one of the dopest dudes I believe I've ever met in life. Wax is... Wax's drip is crazy. Um, he has a clothing line as well. Um, I don't want to cover it yet because um, I want to wait till my man's drop. I want to wait till I get one of his products to set some light on. I'm, I'm going to give you guys, I'm going to show you guys on stream though, his brand, what he has so far on his page and everything. But um, I definitely, well, I, d I don't like to review nothing I don't have in hand. Because other than that, you're just looking at it. I like to show love to people. You know what I mean? I like to show love, support, and get it back. You know, physical health is definitely more important. I need to t and I tell myself that. I tell my fat ass that every day to get the fuck up and go fucking walk two miles or so. But I think my fat ass listen now. But my fat ass quick to order a fucking cheeseburger. I'll tell you that much. <laughs> All right, let's get it. Thanks, everybody, for coming in. Welcome to the Come Kick It stream, where I'm going to be talking about undiscovered brands or just low-key brands, stuff that's not popping up on the market, how they compare to big brands and that bullshit they be on, um, bootleg frenzies. I don't know. You know, we're just talking about brands and just people I fuck with, I follow. Um, I, I had the chance to purchase their stuff personally, um, and interact with them, get to know a little bit about what they're about, um, get to see what they're doing, um, and just see art. You know, that, that's that's just the main thing of it. Um, as I expressed last time, and I'm going to always say in every one of my streams, um, art is art. Um, and people don't people that, that don't know about sneakers and urban cult, uh, urban streetwear, um, that's art. That's fashion to us. Um, colors, vibrant, matching. Um, sneakers, clothes, drip. That's all art. Fashion is a form of... Uh, ident I, I, I identify yourself? No. Um... <laughs> What the fuck is the word I'm looking for? Um, order, make it a richie. Let's go. Let's order. You can't go wrong with a cheeseburger, though, for real. Um, fashion is a sense of I'm I'm all I'm all about people. Um, what the fuck is the word I'm looking for, bro? <laughs> Yo, um, you guys know what I'm talking about. Um, but art itself, expression. There you go. Art is about expressing yourself. Fashion is art. I'm all about expressing yourself no matter what. I would never judge anybody by an outfit they wear or anything that they have on. Um, however you feel you're expressing yourself and however you want to express yourself. And people express themselves different, different ways and I respect and love that. You know, we got to stop shaming people. We got to encourage people to love themselves more. You know what I mean? So, um, individual, yes, individuality. There you go. That's another word I, I could have used as well. Buddha, big Buddha, baby. So we're gonna start off. Um, what I'm gonna do first and foremost, um, I want to cover my best friend's brand. Um, you know, just cause it's my boy. <laughs> you know, simple as that. It's my boy's brand, and he got a drop coming out this week. So um, let's get to it. Bam. Um, so. My boy, my boy, my boy are hot. You feel me? It's coming out with a drop this Friday. Why can't I blow this shit up, bro? Come on, man. 
Yo, this should be tweaking. Why can't I blow it up? Why can't I blow it up? Why can't I blow it up? Why, why, why can't I blow it up? I, I be trying to blow this page up to show it on people on stream. But this web page be acting like it don't know what I mean. Hey, hey. Don't know what I mean. Hey, hey. I be chilling, I be cooling, I be coasting, I be gramming. On this track, I'm slamming. Hey, I shouldn't have been a rapper. Nah, I should have been a trapper. Hey, hey, hey. Even if you want the bricks, no, no, really, don't hit me if I don't want no bricks. I don't got bricks in my house. My house concrete. I'm trying to blow this page up. What is good with this shit? Where does Zoom at? Um, oh, right here. The Zoom right here. Bro, 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 bro. I'm old. There we go. We can show. Oh, that's how I blow it up. Boom. So, folks, this is my boy's brand. Um, our hot bring, bring peace. In case you guys don't know, I didn't cover him a lot last time. Um, just because it was the first time. It was the first time. I was streaming like a sneaker show, so I didn't really want to get into it. Um, because I didn't know if it was gonna be a flunk or not, but I think I'm on to something here. I think I'm really on to something here. So this is my boy's personal page. I'm not gonna go into all this. But um he dropped his brand brand announcement on Peace Day. International Peace Day. Um, this is what it is. I've decided to announce my brand Arhat. Arhat is a Buddhist term, meaning someone who has achieved the goal of life through nirvana and peace. I have been developing sneakers and full clothing line along my, along with various accessories from my first drop, which would be about announcing announce about a month or so. The dub on my Arhat Dunk Low rep represents the inter international symbol of Peace's Dove minus the olive branch. The dove is embroidered with a sewn on removal strap for your own customization. The sneakers were made with peace in mind. Now, I've known my boy, I don't even know. It's been 10 plus years. Just, let's just keep it at that because uh, it don't even matter at that point. Um, my boy has always been making sneakers, like sh like clothes and stuff. He's always been designing his own stuff um, freehand. You know, he's never really come out with... Uh, Dope premise. Love. I, I, you, I, I do love the premise too. And um, we had to talk about this. It was one day on um, Mike Up? No, Stereos. Stereo app. Something like that. It was like some talking app. Um, and we were talking about like how people overuse the Reaper nowadays. Now, I, I don't believe in overusing something. If something works and you can make your own variation to, to it, as long as you're not stealing somebody's concept and you know, you're doing your own thing with it, I don't think the Reaper can ever die. Reaper is just a Reaper, um, personally. But, you know, everybody has their own opinion, whatnot. I love the Reaper. Um, I love Warren Lotus stuff. You know, that's just me personally. <laughs> but um, I'm wait. I'm mad this dude never dropped this this fucking color. I love this. This is like that Pepsi blue color. So this is my boy. You know, and his brand. Um, he came out with one drop, which I reviewed, reviewed last time. The Co-Frag ones. Um, I don't think I ever wear my shits. Probably, probably, probably not. But he's coming out with his second drop this friday um collabing with imposter studio i'm gonna get into little imposter i'm gonna get into imposter studio after that after this but i just want to review what exactly is dropping so of course oh wait can i oh, okay so he's dropping the chain um which i can give you guys a sneak peek to Fuck with Warren. The way he did that whole bootleg Nike was wrong. Though he fucked up the show. I don't know if he messed. I don't. I, you see, the thing is, um, Wax. I've been off. As I told you, I've been off social media for a while. If it wasn't for streaming on Twitch, I wouldn't be on social media. I hate social media. Um, but I need it for promotion purposes. So I haven't really followed Warren. Um, I know about him just because of news and like I, I read some stuff. Like I've kept in loops here and there. I don't know how the drop went and everything like that. Um, I liked the Nike. I don't know about the sneakers, but I liked how he was bootlegging Nike stuff. He was just throwing the fucking Reaper on LeBron James and on Venom, on Jason, on the soccer jerseys. I think that was dope, you know, to start out or just get a buzz going. You got you to gotta create frenzy somehow, personally. 
Yeah, I hate social media. Um, that's why. That's why, like, on my social media stuff, all you see is like men in clothes and sneakers. That's all I follow it for. <laughs> just, just that in gaming. Yeah, that's it. But um, this is the chain right here. It's gold plated. Um, I've had this chain for about a month. I never shot. I've never showered with it. At first. I've never showered with it, but I've worn it like almost every. I, I don't take this chain off unless it's to shower. Can you let me turn the blur off this damn camera? Them dental lows are needed though. Factual, man. Speaking factual. All right, I'm gonna turn this. I'm gonna turn this noise removal off my camera. Don't judge my background because I'm putting on my TV and my my, my apartment's a mess right now. So. But this is the chain. Um, this is the detail of it. Yo, camera fix. It's a cute ass little chain. But he's dropping that along with a T and those denim dunks. These are the back of the dunks. I'm gonna be honest. I'm not too big on jewelry either. You feel me? I'm not. I'm really not too big on jewelry at all. But um, it's my boy stuff, and I'm gonna support. And that goes to say, with I'm not a fan of these denim dunks. I'm not. I, I'm just. I'm just not. I'm a cop because it's my boy. Um. And I, I rock them, but I probably barely. I'm not a fan of denim on sneakers at all. I'd rather wear denim. Um, but I've seen these from his sample pair when he first came out with them. This is one of the first pairs he's ever shown me. And, um, they're, they're good quality for what he has. And he's going to make an even better quality, of course, when he does the production for them. Um, but they're clean. I wish it was lighter denim. Well, why do I keep going to this? Fuck. So this is the, col the collab with Impasta was on the shoe. It was on the tee. Um, from all walks of life, we are one. I, I mean, I'm more excited for the T than the actual sneakers. I agree with you. I actually agree with you, Wax. I think he did a way better job uh, than any SB or any Jordan brand did with any kind of denim. But my plan is to fuck them up. Like, I already told them when I get, when I actually get mines, I'm going to... I'm going to take, I'm going to find like some stone and like graze the hell out the denim. I'm going to probably rip it. I'm going to probably throw some, like some, um, some bleach spots on it. You know what I mean? Yo, bleach your denim. You got to bleach your denim. If you don't know about bleach, bleach rip denim, I don't, I don't, I, I, you got to get off this pot. You got to get off the stream. If you don't know about the bleach and rip denims. I'm more excited about the tea than the actual pair of dunks, but I'm, I'm excited for it. It's going to be a great, it's going to be a good drop. It's going to be a really good drop. A lot of people looking forward to it. I don't know if he has any more photos of the actual denim dunks on here. Does he? No, I think he only shown on IG story about it. But let's go into my boy Impasta. So now. Oof, I was thinking about it. I was thinking about fully dip dye mine. So the collab with Impasta. So I'm not sure about the relationship between them two, about how they met, or anything like that. All I personally know is um, it was one day me and my, me and my boy used to be on stereo every day, and one day he came up and he was just like, uh, yeah, you know, um, this my this Rob, this some dude I know, and I was chopping up when we talked about sneaker game, we talked about brands from back then. And then I was like, yeah, man, how old are you? He's like, I'm 18. I'm like. This little dude, 18, know about the, the OG shit. That's what I'm saying, man. I'm you might if you get in the you get if you get the kicks, you might as well get the T. But um, this dude in pasta, I I liked what he was talking about with sneakers and everything like that. I didn't know too much about what he was into. I didn't know he was into customizing kicks, or just customizing really. Um, in general, I know he was. I didn't know he was into painting, whatever. So. I had these pair of ones, these one mids. Mids are cool. I don't care what people say. You rock what you want. Um, let me skip it real quick. I don't want to ruin it. I don't want to ruin it. So I had these ones. My girl bought me. Um, and I kind of wanted to get something done to them just to make them pop a little bit. I was thinking at first the Chicago colorway. Right? So I was like, you know, just get a pair of... Uh... Yo, for real, it is. Because, well, when he was, when he was spitting... 
like he was 18. I'm like, yo, this dude's talking like he from from my area. He was talking about 0406 shit. I'm like, yo, what's good with this guy? He's only 18? Like, yo, you travel back in time? So I wanted to get these customized, but I didn't know what. Now, um, not to go into Cool Kai too much. I'm going to get into Kai. I want to talk a little bit about him and what's going on with him. Well, from what I know. Kai had a pop-up in Houston. Um, now I don't live in Houston. I couldn't. I'm not. And I'm not gonna go to Houston because I'm not a. I'm not a big supporter of them like that. You know what I mean? Like as some people are, with respect. You know what I mean? So boom, he had came out with these, and I was like, "Yo, I like the colorway." And if I had a chance to cop them, I would have. Yo, he was for the culture. So I was like, you know what? Let me hit up Imposter and ask him to customize it. And bro, when I tell you this man did his thing with them, I just sent him the picture. He says, say, say less. And that's the final product. So the man took these and turned them into those. Look at the paint job on them. Look at the, look at the soul. The age, so look at the laces he did on him. Oh man, look at the he, he flipped the box. I, I, I love create, I love creativity, man. I love creativity. I love that, like that Mr. Sabotage type of creativity. Um, imposter ego wax. <laughs> so, um, I asked him a little bit about himself, you know, and I was like, Bro, um, can you tell me a little bit, a little bit about yourself? And um, he's he's got a pair. Of, he got a pair of dunks. I'm work, he's working out for me too. But I'm 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 leaving it. I'm not gonna show. You, I'm not gonna tell you. I'm looking on it. Age cream lace. Yo, they really were. And he he came up with that concept himself. Wax. So I was like, bro, for the stream, I, I need to know exactly what Imposter Studio is. And that man got into it. He's like, first off, almost everyone thinks it's something to do with Among Us, which is not. Oh, what? <laughs> Among Us, Among Us, Among Us, Among Us. It's gonna die out while I plan on an actual brand. It's more street or urbanized take on imposter. There's too many fake people pretending to be genuine in this world, especially on social. Oh, okay. My work, on the other hand, is authentic like me. I let my work and design speak for themselves. I do plan on building a story behind the brand as well. Oh, okay. I'm working on a collection for last. Okay, let me. I'm not gonna out him out like that. But he's a creator. You know what I mean? He's a creator. Um, and he's put me on game with some stuff, and he's. I love people that can just create, that can just take something and make art of it. He had the flames to himself. Look, type was type was stenciled in. Came on the flames. With free handed tongue tags were cut, painted, and sewn onto the sneaker. Base pair of the strays. Venice highs did his thing to him. As a genius, he died his nine nineties. I'm gonna show you what he's working on now. He, so he has a pair of uh, the Shadowed 1 2.0s. And that's what he did to him. That's what he's doing to him. These are the Shadow Gray. These are the Gray and Black Shadow 1 2.0s. And that's what he's doing to him. Inspired by, yep. Man, it's sick. Man, it's sick. So I got a pair of them. I mean, I got my pair here, not a pair of them. And bro, they, they could not they could not be cleaner. I mean, the paint was so fucking well done. He did his thing with the swoosh, you couldn't even tell. Like, bro, he they blessed him. Yo, follow him for real, Wax. He is gifted, man. And he's so he's so for the culture for his age at 18. He's so for the culture. Yo, I, I, don't, I don't ever want to wear these because I don't want to mess them up. I don't want to mess with the paint job he did on them. But damn, these are, these are so... He did such a fucking good job. These are so beautiful. These are like the, legit the best pair of ones I ever own. Just because of like... I don't know. Just because of the cons. I don't know. I don't know. I just love them. He did his thing with them. And Pasta, if you here, boy. Yo, <laughs> for real, right? I said the same thing. I'm like, yo, this man... When I got in my hand, I was like, yo, this man really want to make me bust out mids. I mean, like, ain't nothing wrong with mids. You know what I mean? But, yo, man did his thing with them. The inspiration was buying the cool Kai colorway. Um, so now, 
we gotta get into the nitty gritty of it. Ugh, I hate to do it. Um, before before I get it, before I say this, before I do anything like this, um, I'm never on here. I'm not a gossip dude. Um, I'm not somebody to spread gossip, spread fake news. Um, I only report what I report for the culture. And um, I want to get into this cool Kai beef. But before I do, I want to personally show y'all like I actually was rocking with dude. You know what I mean? So like this isn't like me throwing shade on his name. This isn't me talking bad about him. None of that stuff. So look, I didn't know about Kai. I didn't know about nothing about him. When I started, when I started getting the idea about doing this thing, I wanted to get a pair of Kai's to review. So I messaged him like, hey man, barely on social media, but started utilizing it because of my streaming. Love your kicks, missed out. I wanted to support. I didn't ask him for a pair for free. That's one thing I never fucking do. I never, 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 never do. I never ask nobody no shit for free. I want to spend my bread on it. If you choose to send me something yours for free, that's on you. But me personally, if I reach out to you, I'm asking for you. I'm asking to pay you bread to support. I've mentioned in my stories a couple times. Um, he has some posts look for feedback or like reactions. I reacted with him a couple times, mentioned him, mentioned him, mentioned him. I copped two of his tees and I copped the pre-order from him. Um, so I've supported him. I copped two tees from him. One I received. The other one, I don't know where the fuck that one is. I call my bank to let's leave that alone. I, got, I did a pre-order in the Canary Yellows for him. I haven't gotten anything, anything on that. That's been a month now. So those are still cooking. They're still. But there's been like some speculation that this man don't ship his stuff. Um, where's Cool Kai the Scammer? All right. So there's uh, there's this page. But uh, this page is kind of wild. On them. <laughs> they, be, they be getting them. This page just be getting them. So... The situation with Kai, let me let me not even go to there first. Um, I appreciate that, Wax. I appreciate that. <laughs> I message ass pizza. <laughs> um, where are they at? We're superb. Okay. So before I get into, like I, I'm, I'm showing you, like it's not like I'm, it's not you know before some some something comes up like oh you, yeah you was dick riding me before or whatever. Like in case he gets wind of this, whatever the case may be, can't like yeah I've seen that. I've seen that. And, and and that's why I'm here to talk about the, talk about man. We got to talk about. It. I know I'm gonna be putting people on blast if they hate me or whatever. But that's why I, that's why I wanted to show you. I was in I was in Kai's DMs. Yes, I was. I was trying to support the dude. I wasn't asking for no handouts. I was trying to support the dude. I was trying to cop some stuff from him. So when he had some stuff on the site, I cop I cop a T-shirt from him. I cop two T-shirts from him because that that Houston that Houston T-shirt he had with the Cowboys smoke rolling a blunt that was dope. And I cop some kicks from him. I was like, yo, let me see what they're about. I always want to see it, but yo, it's funny how it was all good just a week ago. So two weeks ago, from what I've seen, something had surfaced where um, Kai supposedly stole another brand's logo, and it's the boat. Now there was a photo. Hold on, let me pause the music on this right quick. Um, this dude is dope as shit. No, who the fuck is Malachi? Okay. There we go. All right. So there's um yeah this photo had surfaced. Right, motherfuckers. Like, yeah, but they it will they they will you know what I mean? I'm just covering my tracks. Why actually feel me like. I'm showing it like, hey, I was, I was trying to support the dude, like it ain't like I'm, I ain't like I'm, I'm some new dick rider trying to hate on him. I was actually trying to support him. I saw dudes from Jersey, people was loving the hype. I knew I got some friends that actually did that do have his kicks, so I was like, cool, you know, let me support the dude. He from Jersey first and foremost, and people loving his shit. Let me see what they're about. I wanted to see him for myself. So this dude Ma Molly, you know, th and this is where it came about. It's supposed, it's supposedly that Kai had took this lightning bolt concept from this brand who has it trademarked so so um i had tagged superb in a post now i'm not thinking yo whenever i tag somebody in a post i'm just praying to god it's like an alley you somebody like somebody answers me because i only got like 200 followers you know what i mean i ain't nobody big i, I got like two posts on my shit whatever so I was like, bro, give me the details. Let me talk about it on Twitch stream. You know, you deserve a praise. 
Because if they did have this brand and then that dude Kai stole off of it, come on, you can't. You, you you can't do that. That that's come on, man. End of the day, it's, it's a lot of money for everybody. You probably could have worked with them as Omi did. So they sent me these videos, which I've never watched, and I want to watch them on stream. So let's this take is the original company that that made that Thunderbolt on sneakers, and he took that shit from a black company and made it into his own shit. And ain't nobody bitching at him because of that because it's a small company. These dudes been around since forever with that Thunderbolt on all sneakers. They do them on all sneakers. They you you hijack them under Jordan One with the Thunderbolt to the point that they stopped making it because you kept you took their shit. And ain't nobody giving this people like their respect. This is a black owned company. This company came out with that Thunderbolt four years ago, on a, on a Jordan One, and ain't nobody fucking like, oh shit, Kai, you stole it from them because he's the one now pushing that shoe forward. But he's took it from them, and everybody mad at me. Nigga, kiss my ass, nigga. That's my shoe now. I'm gonna give. Matter. This is the original. Oh man, Omni is no joke. Superb, hit me up, bro. I'm gonna break you down with some royalties because you're the original. Oh, I'm gonna break Superb down with some royalties because they're the original black black owners of, of, of the Thunderball on the shoe. But ain't nobody talking about that. This nigga made club foreign bootlegging Mercedes BMW. You made all that bootleg shit. <laughs> I I ain't gonna I ain't gonna I ain't gonna I ain't gonna go with the hate. I'm not with the hater talk. Not that he's a hate. Nah, I'm I'm just spitting facts. But I'm, I'm not gonna go animosity on it. He sent me these videos, but I'm mean, probably just going off. But that's the, that's the main concept of it. So I was like, you know what? And this I could tell is a this is a brand. This is a brand. Cause I was like, you know what? It came to my, it came to my mind. I was like, yo, whatever you guys have on hand, can you ship it to me and let it, let it let it come within a day or two? Whatever you guys can do, let me review your kicks on stream. Show these guys some love. This dude told me, yo, email, Mo message Molly B. Oh, wait, I think I probably, yeah. Why, why am I going back? Well, yeah, I'm stupid. I'm burnt out. My boy Plebby. Fresa Boys. I can't show you how to Fresa Boys chat. I can't show because it's too much cooking in there. I can't show the Fresa Boys chat, Wax. It's too much cooking in there. You feel me? It's too this is one of my boys that, that rocks Kai. Um, I knew I knew him from way back. Um, He's a rapper now. Big props. Check out Fue Fuego Gamo. So one of my, one of my boys, and he he was he's old, he's OG sneakerhead too, you know what I mean? So he was rocking with Kai. So I'm like, bet my home, like I know some dudes rocking with Kai. You know what I mean? So I was like, cool. Let me um let me support him. So as I'm trying, like I'm trying to I'm trying to let put it out there that I, I'm not no I'm not hating on this dude because I'm not. I was I want dude to win. I want everybody I know to win. I just want to dress some stuff for the culture, and I, I really want to shed light on this brand because they're fucking dope. So I messaged Molly B after Superb told me to. Why is my they not okay? I I guess maybe he I don't know where the f I yeah just I don't know whatever. Yo these kicks these kicks go for one fifty right? Wow deja vu. These kicks go for one fifty. I messaged that dude Molly B. He was like, yo, cash at me a hundred. I thought I was a little skeptical at first. I'm like, oh, you want me to cash app you when I could just pay on the website? But I was like, all right, a hundred dollars. I could take the loss. If it comes, I, I, you know, I'm not trying to say, I'm just saying like, you know, cash up, whatever. Yo, do send me the tracking info two days later. Bam. I support, bro. I so I, when I tell you, I support, I support homies. I support brands. I support black, white, Asian, whatever the case may be. But the fact that, you know what I mean? That. They got their shit ripped off by somebody. I had to support. So not even that I support. I wore them. I wore them. Yes. I wore these joints. The first day I got them. I went out Friday night and I wore them. One by my cousin's house. Yo. These shit is fucking comfy. Now, I wish I had a pair of Kai's to review them on. But, you know, resale was crazy. Motherfuckers want eight hundred on eBay. I'm like, ah, right, never mind. <laughs> I, ain't, I ain't, ain't about that. So I wish I had like a pair. Of, I, I can't compare because it's a Jordan One versus a 
uh, actual somebody actual made these sneakers but just you know just to kind of give them out shout out superb too yo for 150 you can't go wrong with some comfortable latino love too <laughs> yeah latino love too latino love too my bad my bad i mean you know what i mean shout out to my latinos latinas yo for 150 you can't go fucking wrong with these sneakers for especially for summertime yo the mesh on these are incredible you breathe it's like you breathing twice. It's like I'm a fish with gills. I got... No, that's a bad comparison. I don't know how to... I don't know. Whatever. But, yo, my feet did not get sweaty in these. You can smell them. They still got the... Fra- I, I, I wore these on a, a hot-ass summer day. A night. The bottom already got dirty. So, that shows I was, like, running it. I was walking in them. Whatever. I was trying to purposely wear these just to get the feel for them. These shits are fucking comfortable. I wish nurses could find out about these. Yo, fuck it. That's what I'm saying. Fuck 800. Do send me this for 100. That's real. That's real branding. I'm not nobody. I got 200 followers. I got like two IG posts. I ain't nobody. You know what I mean? This dude said, yo, I'm a brand. I want the people to support. I want to show love to the people. He told me send him 100. I sent him 100. Boom. Two days later. That's a brand. That's how branding is done. And me and Wax is having this conversation um i'm tired of seeing the celebrities rocking the people's kicks that's cool you know i'm glad you know what it's like i'm glad that a celebrity got wind of you and is supporting you but i want to see the people the, the people be the ones supporting you with a love for the people at the people deserve the love you know what i mean so hey man if you if you're watching this and you in the kicks check out superb sports super, superb b sports we're on ig $150, you get you a nice ass pair. These feel like some hush puppies. You know, and they stylish. Like, look at this color. Yo, my man's gonna send me some bullshit all black stuff. Nah, he sent me the the Miami Night colorway. You feel me? Like he could have you know what I mean? He could have sent me some all black shit. Like, here, take these all black shit. Nah, he sent me some shit that I could fuck with. I got 200 followers on IG. That man don't know me. I don't know him. I messaged him. He, I want to show him love. Boom, hundred dollars. Two days later. Come on, man. And these shits is comfy. And ain't no bullshit. It ain't no bullshit material. Yo, if I could show, let me see if I could show you the mesh on these. Crazy. Like yeah, you. Yo, these are sneakers you're supposed to do this to. But look, look at that. Look, yo, I had dunks the other day that would, <laughs> that would go like that would just stay like. Look at this. Styrofoam box. Come on, man. Yo. Material needs are crazy. Colorway is nice. Lightning bolt. The original lightning bolt. So I had to show love. So supposedly, you know, Kai's going through it. Because ever since that cool Kai scamming page came out, man, a lot of people have been backlashing. And... Then there's the beef with he got with Omi, Omi, and Saya. So Saya made a video. Yo, when I got off stream last time, that's when Saya. <laughs> I I want to say is I want to say is walking shoes more than running shoes. Just I don't I don't know personally. I'm not a big runner, so. But walking shoes definitely those definitely compete with New Balances. I want to say even better than New Balances. Truthfully. You know, I don't I don't get too much into beef. Um but even Saya had a pro Saya was saying I'm gonna just play this one thing from this Saya clip and that's it. Oh no no, this is not the video. Maybe he took it down? No, it was before this. Um yeah, right here. He ain't gonna alright, so he ain't gonna rock. So basically Saya was saying that Kai was hating on him, and I don't know why. I don't know where this. I don't know where this beef be coming from, bro. It's sneaker beef. I never heard of sneaker beef in my life. This is crazy. Social media is nuts. Basically, Sai and Kai got a beef, and now, so Omi got it. Supposedly, Omi got in touch with Superb B Sportswear, and they're gonna make a sneaker that's cheaper than Kai's. To the, they're trying to say the price point Kai should be selling them for, and they're trying to collab. So Omi's trying to get um, Superb B Sportswear paid with what they deserve. 
It's kind of fucked up that Nike came out with the trademark. Because I really wanted him to come out with a legit Air Jordan 1 Kai silhouette. That would have, that would have, and he was going to do it too. But he had to trash all his designs because the trademark. And um, he's still coming out with something because he just uh, passed it, right? He got um two samples coming out. He had two samples. So, yeah. So, he's, he's supposed he's still coming out. He fixed up the panels. He changed it up. He did what he's doing. Um, but he said, it, you know, these are just samples. The, the final version is going to be better. So, um, but I saw Kai today. He shot back. And, um, <laughs> and he posted, um, Kai in a Hellcat. So, um, I mean, Kai knows about the stuff going on, but you know what I mean? But, yo, but there's people claiming that they don't, they don't receive their kicks. Yo, where's my order? Yo. And there's people legit saying like, yo, fuck this beef shit. Where the fuck is my order? Where the fuck is my update? I don't give a fuck about none of this shit. And I agree with that too. I be hating when there's, yo, if you got a cult, like if you got a good like following and people rock with you and support with you, why you, why you pay attention to petty shit, the beef? Like just, 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 yo, just. Give your people the update. Oh, I do want to talk about how Saya made this man sign a lupus check. So this man. <laughs> the triple. Yeah. And, 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 and that's crazy. And that's crazy. That's crazy. Like, how are you selling these for two? Seven? Like, I understand, like. If you had just came out and you're trying to get you trying to get your your business right to charge two two fifty two fifty, but yo you got people rocking with you, bro. You got people that fly to different cities for you. Can't you drop that point that price point? Cause we know what you making from them factories, my guy. Anybody that do, that done their research or that care to do their research, I'm not putting down no black man. I want to support this dude. I cop stuff from him. I got orders of Kai. I got Canary Yellows that's waiting. Um, I got a tea that was shipped that came. I got a tea that's waiting to be shipped. I don't know when that's coming. I emailed him about both. Um, I emailed him about the Canary Yellows too. I was like, yo, can I switch to a size 10? He never got back to me. Um, I would assume since they're in pre, they're in pre-order that he could switch to, he could just order another size 10. Or even if you order the size 10 and a half, he could order another 10 because I'm sure to sell because Kai has a great following, which is great. I'm glad you got a great following, bro. Good for you. Just do right by your people, man. Do right by the people. The culture, the culture is what, 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 what got you. Do right by your people. You know what I mean? It ain't about money. It's about your brand. You, people are gonna support you. Your people love you now for the two seventy five price point. I've seen dudes. I've seen Kai screenshot dudes. I got like four orders pending. Two seventy five times four. You do the math. Cause I'm not. Cause I'm stupid. <laughs> yo, just drop the price points for the people, man. But yo, this dude dropped them lupus kicks like. A month, say a month ago, and suppose he he signed a check for forty k. But Saya went on live a week ago, <laughs> was like, "Yo, where the lupus check at?" The next day, Kai signed this check for twenty k. I don't know how that works. Supposedly, everybody, all these proceeds is supposed to be going to lupus, but now it would change. I know he got more than I know he made more than twenty k off these kicks. Just because the orders. And he got a great following. Respect to homie. I'm glad you got a great following. I'm glad you got a brand. But just do right by the people, bro. There's people on here that's claiming, yo, where my kicks at? See? Look right here. Yo, so the sneak's coming? And there's people that defend him. Y'all call that man out on the checks. Look, where's my kicks? God damn. <laughs> Bro, nobody be hating if you. That's what I'm saying. I'm 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 not I'm not throwing I'm not throwing rocks at the man. I just want the man to address the people. Yo, address your people. Your people asking where the kicks at. Where the kicks at, man? Your, your people want their product. Um, but respect the homie. You know he's doing his thing and he he got a partnership with Dodge, and he actually did sign the check to Lupus. You know, props on him for donating. You know what I mean? I'm glad for him. Great following. He puts out great stuff. I, I love the colorways he comes out with for his ones. You got a patent leather New York Knicks color. Come on, man. I, I told you I had my boy Impostor do the, the Houston colorway just because I liked this so much. And I couldn't go to Houston to cop a pair. Um, but I like what he's doing. You know what I mean? But just stop showing love to the celebrities. Show love to the people too. You know what I mean? That's, that's it. 
And that's all I'm gonna say about it. And that's that, Kai man. Show love to the people. So I want to get into another brand. I I just I, I fucks with. Um, I just got this stuff. Complex, yo. And they just they got a new collection out. I'm about to I'm about to cop after this. Um, I mean I really want to address these. So they had a their one year anniversary or something like that. Complex is two years old today. Why not revamp the infamous NASCAR T? NASCAR 3.0. This T will be featured in our upcoming mini capsule dropping this Friday. So a month later, this T came. Not even a month because it came out Friday. Let me turn off this camera blur. The people made him a millionaire. Now he good. To, yeah, that's what I'm saying, yo. Ain't nothing wrong with showing love to the people. Drop your price points. Make more people order. Have stuff on hand, yo. Just you got the money to pre-order shit. Have stuff on hand. You know what I mean? If you got the shit, to, yo, you got the money to pre-order. Have about 305. Yo, it don't matter how many pairs that man Kai makes. If he makes a thousand pairs or something, it'll sell. It's no way in hell his a thousand pairs of his sneakers. Won't. I'll leave it like that. But you, I agree with you, Wax. But yo, let's get into complex, bro. Bro. What is fucking design? It got that vintage ass 80s rock band. Oh my god. Look at this. I love the vibrant colors in the black. That fucking blue. Look like a it looks like the it looks like a fucking it looks like Silver Surfer came on this shit. Like literally Silver Surfer was fucking to see and came on it. Big vintage vibes. I love it. And he got the, he got the, he got devil down there driving the, you know what I mean? Yo, I saw this and I had to cop. But hold on, hold on, hold on. Y'all see the price point on my man? $18. Now hold up, hold up. Give me a second. This Supreme tee was 60. It ain't bad, you know what I mean? Like, it's, it's Supreme, Stripe. It's a dope shirt. A 60? I mean, I paid for it, you know what I mean? I liked it. I saw it, I was like, cool. It's Supreme, I'm gonna do. No matter what, I'm always love Supreme just because I'm from 05, 06. I'm always love Supreme. A 60. I mean, Complex came out with this tee for $18. Yo, that's what I'm trying to tell y'all. Y'all got to support the small brands. You getting more. Hold on, hold on. I ain't even done. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I had to cop the white one, too. I had to cop the white one. The Saint on the motorcycle. I had to cop the white one. I had to. Because, you know, I got it during summertime. I said, shit, I might not wear this black one until uh, maybe, you know, it start cooling down. So let me get the white one, too. But you know what I love? You know what I really love about brands? Is the stupid ass small shit you get with it. <laughs> I'm not even lying, bro. I'm not even lying. The shit I love about when you buy something from a brand is just like small, stupid ass novelties you get with it. Is a racing... Pa I think he addressed it. Um... Hold on, I think he addressed it. No, he didn't. Damn. It's a racing pass or something of some sort. I don't know. I don't know exactly. Wait, did he? There he goes. Yeah. Oh, all T's will also come with the complex hot pass with the working QR code. You can even try. Oh, hold on. Let me see what the QR code is. Stickers and accessories go such. It, it do. It do. Yo, that is. That's, I love that. Yo, I love when you. I love when they give you like. Cause you know why? You feel a part of the brand when they give you smaller stuff. It's not just. Cause you're not just getting a t shirt. They're like, hey man, take this too. Like, you know, we welcome you into our life. Let me see what this QR code does. I don't know what this QR code does. But there is a QR code. Oh, it takes you to the website. That's pretty dope, though. That's pretty dope. So yeah, the QR code that if you if you cop one of these tees, 
and you got the hot pass you feel me you, you scan the qr code you get access to the website which you can go on right now and cop the latest cop um i love the colors of this shirt and i, I love the people that support him i shouted him out i shouted him out on juneteenth um oh this line green i think i might oh i think i might have to cop that yeah exactly it's like you got it's exact i feel the same way i feel the same way yeah i might have to rock with that that red or green bro i hate being colorblind i'm slightly colorblind i can't just oh this looks like one of those like i don't know if your parents ever came when came back from jamaica and like the airport tees from jamaica <laughs> that's exactly what this remind me of oh the hoodie too nah you surprised us with the hoodie <laughs> I love seeing comments gassing brands up, bro. And look, 620 likes, but man, I love, I love, I love, oh, Ben Simmons, don't do it. Don't do it to Ben Simmons too early. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know. I, I love, I'm, I'm going to hang this on my wall. I'm going to wear this shit right now. I got a hot pass. I feel like I'm backstage at a, a, a at a concert. Let me see what I say. Oh, so along with Cool Kai, um, there's another dude, um, I know for, I knew from back in the day he's from Patterson. I believe so. Um 5 a.m. Rosa, Sam Rosa. Um he's another one that like he I don't know. I don't know the whole story behind him. Um apparently, from what I understand and reading the comments, he's made a bunch of shirts and sold them and has just never nobody's ever gotten their stuff. Um, and look, I'm gonna just click on a random ass photo. Um, see, yes, as I wanted, but all I get is the question: Where the Schmurder tees at? Where the Kobe tees at? Dropping all these important tees, not mailing out a single one. I really want the stuff I spent three hundred dollars on. By the time I get, by the time you get it, Palestine will be free, bro. <laughs> If you're really giving the proceeds to the kids, hell yes. If it's pre-made, yes. Let me get an Israeli 5 a.m. You just lost a fan. I, I don't know why. Oh, nah. Because you, you racist? Nah, get the fuck up out of here. Report this motherfucker. Oh, I'm hate speech, bro. I don't give a fuck if I'm a snitch. I ain't from the streets. I mean, I am, but I ain't no... I ain't no you know what I mean? Nah, we don't, we don't tolerate hate speech. Oh, my God. What is wrong? Yo, internet is a scary-ass place, bro. Um, but I, the only reason I'm bringing them up is I'm not trying to hate on them. I'm not, I'm not hating on them. Jersey, you feel me? Like, I, I, um, so he put out this DMX tee I, I got Friday. Um, it, it was, I don't, I don't know. It was supposed to come a couple weeks ago. Are you making any of the tees? Um, so look, this is the DMX tee right here. Um, it's fucking dope. Um, it's fucking dope. And it's DMX too, you know what I mean? It's X. Rest in peace, X. So you got this, and you got the. Back. I love when fucking I have writing on the back of a T-shirt. Yo, I love I love tees that have writing on the back. I don't know why. I just love any T-shirt, long as it got something in the back. You have a big ass penis on the back. I don't care. I love when I love when a T-shirt has details on back and front. Um, but you know, I got this T. You know, he shipped it out. I got it. You know. So I don't know. He he's and then this T. So I got this from um, the Connect Montclair. Um, when I had went there to buy and trade some stuff. Um, this is one of his designs, a Dior. I got it to support the homie. You know what I mean? I was like, yo, you guys got any Rosa tees? This one I like. This is a, it's a. I, I like colors. I like colors. I like colorful shit. Um, but that's why I'm bringing them up. Um, I I. I, I by bringing up Kai and Rose, I'm, I'm not throwing shade at them or talking shit about them. It's like, man, yo, people... And, like, people are not asking for refunds. People just want their stuff. Legit. People just want their stuff. But I see Kai is actually, um... Not Kai. I see Rose is trying to make amends. Um... He came out with some idea for the scratcher. If you had a previous order. Um... So this is it right here, I think. Fill out the form below with all your information and order info regarding any order in the year 2020. 2021 orders are still being processed and will be produced and shipped out as soon as you receive them in hand. Which he did. I got my DMX tee. You know, I can't say he's not shipping stuff out because I did get my DMX tee. Um, please allow some time for refunds to be processed. Everything will be specified in the mail. You all receive the gift cards to be used automatically. 
activated pre-orders back orders 2020 was 2020 was not only a tough year for the world but for me as well my first year in business and a tough one at that i learned my lesson the hard way and figured out a solution so honestly i can respect that he admitted he was wrong he's trying to make amends for it and he told like i'm human it was my first year in business i didn't know you know, I don't know if it was the money that got to him. I don't know if it was the greed. I don't, maybe he was just feeling himself like, you know, damn, like I'm putting out stuff and people loving it, people selling it. I don't know. I, I, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm never going to speak bad about anybody because there's two sides to every story. Um, You know, and so I, I can't say anything bad about anybody. But that's why I want to bring up Sam Rosa. Like, yo, he has dope stuff. I like his designs. I like his stuff. Um, he's trying to make stuff right with his people. Of course, you know, you, you'll never satisfy 110% of people because they're always going to be pissed that they spent, they sp and rightfully so, they spent their hard work and money. Um, they haven't got what they ordered for, um, you know. But um, he's at least trying to make it right. He's addressed it. He's trying to do something. Um, I fuck with him. I fuck with his designs. I fuck with his art. I fuck with his stuff. Um, Rosa, ship your stuff, bro. People want to enjoy it. Let the people enjoy it. He did come out with some dope stuff. I love this. It's like it's like Basquiat esque. But I got my DMX T. I'm just saying. It sucks for y'all. <laughs> it don't suck. Um. But yeah, man, you know, when you, when you got a good brand like Rosa and Kai does, you know, people just want their stuff. And and that Kai, that cool Kai scamming page, they even said it. Like, the only reason that they exist is, is because he's been taking people's money, not shipping their kicks. If he shipped people's kicks, they wouldn't exist. That's all he wants. He just wants the people. And that's what I want. I want, the, I, want the, I want my people, the culture, to get what they ordered for. You know, I'm a hardworking man. I'm not a rich individual. I work nine to six. I'm fucking tired of shit right now. But I've been meaning to... I've been owing a stream for a week now. I want to bring it up. I want to big it up. I want to talk about brands. I want to talk about the people. I want to talk about, you know, stuff that's coming out. Let's check out, let's check out some stuff coming out. Let's check out Cap Secrets. Let's check out Cap Secrets. See what's coming out. Oh, ooh. The Wade. The way the, yo, the, yo, this series is what, uh, yo, this series is what made me a Wade fan when Wade took over and beat the beat the Mavericks ass. Oh, uh, damn, I actually, I'm, I'm actually at the cop that jumbo screen print. Oh, I love that. I love when, I love when a screen print just takes over the whole t shirt. I hate small bubble shit. I love us, I love when a t shirt just that's what you're buying for. I want the whole, I want the whole shit covered in. I might have to cop that. Orange point. Oh, okay. He's giving us boy. Oh, hockey mirror. Damn. Go come to the east side. Ooh. I mean, I fuck with truckers. But, uh, there's only one trucker I fuck with. I mean, you know, there's only one trucker I really fuck with. There's only one trucker I fuck with, and that's the boy Fruit. You feel me? That's, uh, that's it. That's it. That's it. I like truckers. Don't get me wrong. Um, before they were a trend, I, I'm kind of mad now, but um, I only got one trucker. I'm riding with my boy Fruit. You feel me? But um, that was a dope trucker. And Fruit got some shit out too. We're gonna review that after. That's a nice truck. All black leather truck. Ooh, down for the summer. Gold River 93. Let's go. Ooh. Underdog has some crazy pieces in the works of the June collection. 623. Um, let's check out Underdog. Let's check out Underdog. That's a pretty dope tee. Ooh, look at the bag. I fuck with the skull. Okay, underdog got some fire. Let's check out my boy AJ Fruit though. Let's check out Fruit, man. 
See what I mean? Like, well, well, I can't, I can't get some other trucker because my boy Fruit got the fruit. You know what I mean? I can't, my boy Fruit got the fruit. You know what I mean? Ooh. I think that's his next one coming out. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. That man's spicy. Ooh. That man's spicy. <laughs> That man is spicy with the heat. Let me tell you about let me tell you about this hat. That fruit, fruit sent me an all white hat. So what I did is um I copped on um, five pins, right? I copped five pins from fruit. So where are that where are my hats? He sent it to me, and you know, he sent me the hat. He was like, "Well, I sent you the hat because you know you need you need something to put the pins on." That's love, bro. That's love. And I'm not just saying it because I got something free. It's just, oh, when, when that's that, you gotta show love to the people, and that's and that's what I'm telling Kai, and that's what I'm telling Sam, the Five AM Rosa to do. Show love to the people, because the people without the people, you'd be nothing. People deserve the love. It's cool. It's cool. Celebs rock with you. It's cool celebs fuck with you and everything like that, but the people is what got you where you at on that platform. You gotta show love to the people. You know what I mean? Gotta show love to the people. Was I supposed to cover anything else? I'm trying to think. I think that's pretty much it for now. Um, I know it was a quick stream in an hour. I'm sorry. I don't have much. I don't have a lot more to go out with. Um. And that's what that's why I wanted to do these once a month so I can gather stuff to go over with you guys. But I think I went over a decent amount, covered our hot, talked to my boy Impasta, Fruit for Life. You know, I, I paid homage to Superb. Make sure you guys go out and cop a pair of those sneakers. Cop anything from them. You know, just show love to them. Um, showed off the homie complexes T. I can't wait to wear these shits, man. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this one more time. Whew. Whew. You know what? I might not wear it. What I might do is I might. I'm going to soak it in water. I'm going to let this shit dry to get ashed and aged. An ashy gray. Make it look really vintage. But I'll uh, make sure you go cop my boy stuff this Friday. Them denim low dunks. Wax, thanks for hanging out with me. Mike, I appreciate you being here. Everybody that's been here with me, rocking me for an hour. I know it was a short stream. My bad. Um, I'm on vacation starting right now, actually. So I'm going to probably stream tomorrow. Probably sh play some pew pews or whatever. Then I'm going to play some pew pews Wednesday. Then I'm in Minnesota for a week. So no streams for me from Wednesday, uh, from yeah Thursday beyond. I'll be back Tuesday next week, but um, Tuesday, tomorrow, Wednesday, I'll be streaming. I try to put together two long streams, four or five hours. I rock out with some games. I don't know. We gonna play some shit, but some shit I could, I could, I could, I could fuck around with and, and still chat with my peoples. Um, thanks for rocking out with me, guys. As always, you guys, are, you people are lovely. Whether you tuned in for one minute to one hour, um, you could have been anywhere else in the world, but you were here with me, listening to me talk about fabric. <laughs> I can't tell you how much that means to me. Um and these and these are uh, these uh these sneaker streams, these fashion shows, the come kick it stream will be about two hours long. Um every time like I said, every month I'm gonna try to I'm gonna try to yeah, get it once a month. Not not like every month not every month on a dime. Wait till I, I get like a bundle up of stuff coming in. To, um, you know what? Let's go through some sneak releases. Let's rock out. Let's rock out. Let's rock out. Let's see what. Let, let's check out nice kicks. Let's see. What, let's see what sneakers coming out. Cause I, I am a fan of sneakers. Still, I, I don't just wear just bootlegs. You know, I, I wear some other. I wear other sneakers too. So um, let's see what's coming out. No, um, sneaker releases. What the fuck? Yo, what are I use for sneaker releases? Sneaker news. I gotta check out. I check out sneaker news. Vacation baby. Let's go. Oh. God, I want to talk about the fucking twos. Oh, my God. No, where's the black ones at? Yes. Oh, Jesus Christ. Look at these. Oh, man. Now, I'm a fan of black sneakers with color in them. But, yo. 
I don't know if it's the laces. I don't know if it's the le that leather. How crisp it looks. Might be the laces. Yeah, it is the laces. Yeah, because if they were black, it, yeah. I don't know, but these are fucking crazy. I might have to I might have to pay stock X prices for these just cause, just cuz. Um I've been a fan of two lows. Um I like I like I like twos. Um two highs, everyone went crazy for the chromes. Rightfully so, but my favorite pair of twos were uh hold on. Jordan two university blue low. Oh, I guess I didn't type in two. Okay. Fuck you. Oh, look at those. I typed in two, bro. What the fuck are you showing me fours and elevens for? These right here. I remember when these dropped. Um, let's test my sneaker knowledge. Let's say these dropped 2000. Yeah. Two. Um, is there a website for? Oh, I want a website. Okay, whatever. But I I love I love blue. Blue is my all time favorite color. Um the Carolina with the navy. Oh my goodness gracious. These are my all time favorite two. So I was pretty happy I'm seeing twos are uh, getting back some loves again. Um Oh, we gotta talk about the unions too. Oh my which one I, I'm fucking with the moss colorway. Um I like vibrant colors. I love vibrant colors. I love bright. I love sticking out. I love standing out. Mostly because my sneakers are always the most colorful things on me. And then my outfit could be plain as J. I probably wear these with like a white tee, some some bullshit, like a Polo Ralph Lauren tee, some shit. Um, I like being plain. I like being comfy. Um, only stunt when I'm out with my girl um, at a party, something like that. Or like a backyard party. I don't go clubbing like that. But like if I'm on date night with my girl, I'll flex. Um, we go to a city. We like whenever me and my girl go to a new city, we usually walk around for like hours upon hours. So I usually like wear. That's why I usually dust off an outf outfit and flex. Um, but the unions, I seen that the union line was crazy. Um, a lot of people are not going with the gray pair, but I want the moss pair. Um, it's good to see everything else besides a one getting some love these days. Just glad I'm glad to see. Glad to see some other, uh, glad to see some other, some other sneakers getting some love. Um, Kit that avails his classic summers. You know, we, we, let's check out Kit after this. I kind of hate how Kit just throws Kit on something and it, one of the Puerto Rico purple, purple, uh, silver bullets. <sighs> I really wanted to shout out to, shout out to my Boricuas. I don't care how many styles I take on sneakers. I will never buy off stock X. <laughs> We're fuck cock X, man. Um, N7 dunk lows are on Nike by you. You can swap out the colors and the spirit of design with the, I kind of like the tongue on these. I mean, the swoosh. What the fuck is wrong with me? These are different. Um, a little too different for me, but my boy wax could definitely pull these off. My wax and plevy could definitely juice those yo look at that midsole yo if the midsole looks like that that that's actually gonna be a beautiful shoe i like that midsole that cracked oh my god people too scared to be different man people too scared to be different um those are actually pretty all right. I like those. Ooh, those are kind of hard. Nike Dunk Low Cheat. Eh, I'm over dunks. These are kind of dope. I can't see myself copping it, but you know what? I'm what I'm going to hate. Oh, with a matching Kuji. Yo. Wax, we got to bring back Kuji, bro. I was trying to get easy front up to Vegas and stock X this year. <laughs> fuck stock X, Mike. You can't order off stock X, man. You gotta go to a sneaker boutique. And fuck with the resale price. You gotta fuck with the boutiques, man. Stock X is a piece of shit. 
stock XP on some bullshit. Damn, I can't wait for those twos to drop. I might have to go crazy on those. Ooh, oh! When does South Beach 8s coming? Yo, when the South Beach 8s first dropped in 2010, where was I? Yo, 2010, 2011, I don't give a shit. That was the best years of sneakers for me personally. Damn, I remember these. You know what I even remember with these? Uh, for anybody that remembers the fucking the, f the electric blue foams that had came out um, that people went nuts for and they were switching the they were switching the blue laces for the pink oh, let me see if I can find I definitely can um, electric blue foams let me see if it just pops up off the strength let me see if it just pops up off the strength with the pink Ah, look at all these uncultured ass motherfuckers now one natural ah oh, there we go see i knew somebody had it these were like the because everybody couldn't i don't know where the heck the boutique is i'll send you some stuff mike um so you can find those whatever yeezys you're looking for i think i remember which ones you're talking about the phone runners no not the phone runners the cloud walkers cloud runners i don't know so many fucking runner shit yeah these were LeBron eights. Ooh, anybody hit on any? I wonder if people hit on. I wonder how many people hit on the Yeezy slides today. I don't need to hit because I already got them. Thanks to Wifey for Lifey. Ooh, these came out today. Damn, I missed out. I like orange, I love orange, orange and blue. Um, let's see what's. Rumored to be coming out. Well, it's got to be OVO sixes, threes. No, those seven, those those ones are hard. A little too plain though for me. Nothing on here I really like. Are those Bordeaux sixes? Yo, those threes are dope though. They like the off-white ones. Just throw a fucking zip tie on them and you're straight. <laughs> Ooh, A6. Hello. I know about A6 in chat. I know about A6 in chat. I kind of like these, but I, I just can't. Levi mid denims. See the. Why is it light here? Should have at least switched it. No, I should have kept it dark. PGs. Didn't them PlayStation Paul George's came come out? Didn't they drop? Ooh, okay. Hold on. These look a lot better on feet. All right. <laughs> see what I mean? Yo, I hate when I see sneakers in in on screen and they look like shit, but then I see them in person and they look dope. These look kind of dope, man. But I can only wear them like hoodie, like cargo pants, baggy hoodie. Tie-dye shit, too. Ooh. Olive cargos and tie-dye hoodie. Oh, man. There you go, Mike. Asics are the most comfortable in the shoe. Right here, Mike. There you go. June 25th. My foot fetish? Did I? I don't have a foot fetish. I don't really care. Feet, feet. Pre-store rib cage. These are definitely comfortable. I think I'm gonna take. I think I'm gonna wear these to the airport when I go to Minnesota. Pretty 110% confident. This colorway is nice though. I do like this brown colorway. I can wear brown so much more these days. Only the real ones know. Yo, that sole is nice. Everyone gonna love twos now. Facts. Like that comment. I wasn't a fan of the mono packs. Those 14s are blah. I hate forces. Oh man. I missed out on those. I thought it was a chance, but undefeated was for okay. Look, see these are dope. Yo, you can throw a zip tie on these and look just like the off white sail force. Yeah, I want those. What are those called? I think those are called the cloud runners. Let me go back and see. Um, Easy four fifties. I could have sworn a nickname cloud runners. Yeezy 450, man. They're supposed to be dropping four days, Mike. 
Um, I'll send you somebody to see if they can, you can work with them to see if they can cop them, cop you a pair. Thirteens, too bulky for me now. Eleven lows, so underrated. For the first time, Jumpman Twenty Three bringing back the eleven low and its original translucent soul. Did you know MJ wore these in the nineteen ninety six playoffs? No, we didn't know that. Sneaker news. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, <laughs> you stupid ass. Oh, go hoops! They're not the OVO. I thought they were OVO. I'm gonna call it a cloud runner. Oh, these are Bordo. These are Bordo Bordo sixes. Eh, stop it. Keep the sevens. Ew, why do laces look oh god no I hope that's just a drawing. Is the laces gonna look like gonna oh no 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 Virgil stop it stop it eh. Shoot him at Gavin I wasn't a fan of the the cabs the half cabs if y'all don't know what half cabs is I need to get off the stream Um I was a fan of the the yeah, these are lows. The teal lows. I was a fan of those. I don't really see nothing that capture my captures my attention. Um Ice kicks? Nope. I wanna see what complex got. Oh, let's check Union. Cause they had they were wild. Let's see. Damn, two more hours for Damn Everybody lined up. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Yeah, 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 yeah. folks we're gonna cut it there seven o'clock um i want to go lay my ass down in my sweaty ass bed to become cool <laughs> um but thanks for rocking with me this was a long way to stream and i'm sorry i put it off so long um real life gets in the way i am a busy man you know unless y'all want to make me a full-time streamer no i don't um just happy to spend some time with y'all um we'll be back tomorrow we'll be back wednesday you know what i mean um thanks for rocking with me um, it's hot as shit. Make sure I stay cool. Make sure I stay hydrated. Um, mental health always. Always be checking about yourself. It's okay to not be okay. Talk to people. Don't keep it stored in. Um, that's it, folks. Stay lovely. Stay beautiful. I love you all. You know, go enjoy the rest of your Monday. That ID word. <laughs>